Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve a system error 6118 has occurred. The list of servers for this workgroup is not currently available. So this should hopefully be a fairly straightforward tutorial, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So first thing we're going to do is actually open up the start menu. Type in services. Best result should come back with services. You want to go ahead and select services app. Go ahead and just left click on that. Locate the function discovery service. So again, function discovery. And it should say function discovery provider host. Go ahead and double click on that. It says startup type to automatic, and if server status is stopped, you want to start it. Go ahead and select apply and OK. Next thing you want to do after you're done with that is close out of here. Open up the start menu, type in control panel. Best result should come back with control panel. Go ahead and left click on that. Set your view by to category view, and then select network and internet. Select Network and Sharing Center. And then select Change Advanced Sharing Settings on the left side. You want to now go where it says All Networks and expand it by clicking the little downward arrow. And then where it says File Sharing Connections, you want to go make sure to use 128 bit encryption to help protect file sharing connections as well as password protected sharing on. You want to turn both of them on. And once you have it exactly how it appears on my screen, just would select Save Changes, and that should save it. So pretty straightforward process here, guys. You would restart your computer at that point, and then hopefully your issue should have been resolved. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.